Hey guys, good morning again. Okay, so so early. <laughs> I think it's around 5:45. Yeah, about 5:45 in the morning. Okay, so I am back with this awesome bracelet. I really like it a lot. Okay, I don't know. I kind of like really tend to be very attracted to the designs of this wonderful designer. Okay, because there's just really something artistic about the way he creates <coughs> sorry his bracelets and the person that i'm talking about is g the loomster life okay and this is called tarzan okay this is the tarzan bracelet by g the loomster life oh by the way this was named by the super wonderful suzanne hb on youtube and crazy just my work on instagram and this interesting bracelet is called tarzan okay I think it's because it goes left to right, you know, the pattern, you know, and it reminds us of, of course, even me, I think, reminds me of Tarzan, like, swinging from branch to branch. <laughs> so, okay, since the vines in the middle, they look like vines that go from left to right. And, of course, there's this beautiful teardrops, okay? Um, it can be going upwards, it can be going downwards, depends on how you want to wear it. All I know is that this is an awesome bracelet! I love it a lot okay so anyway before i speak so much again <laughs> i heard some someone commented on my youtube please don't talk too much <laughs> sorry i'm talkative i apologize okay so for this i'm going to be using my marble tie-dye my mar well no the marble collection the limited edition and the jet black okay and i will be using the jet black the cylindric black as the middle Okay, chain and then the marble will be my teardrops okay so when you start the first thing that you will get should be the teardrop color okay <clears throat> so for the teardrop color you just loop one band on your hook and then create a cat band okay sorry my nail is dirty yo okay <laughs> now you're gonna look at it <laughs> okay so you create that cat band and then followed by your chain collar okay and loop that cap band on the chain collar okay there you go and then the next color that will follow will be another teardrop and this will be the very first teardrop okay so you will get your teardrop color again which is don't be confused it's different colors but it's all from the marble collection so i will get my next teardrop i'll just refer to it as a teardrop so the next the first teardrop will be here uh, uh, place it on your hook and then loop the first band on it okay and then close it like that so it's supposed to look like that okay then you get again your chain color which is the black so it's really alternating you know the chain color and then the teardrop the chain color and then the teardrop okay so now you get the chain color the first one you loop one band for the next chain color you will loop two because you will loop the whole tear band the whole tear band <laughs> the whole teardrop so this is the teardrop you loop these two okay because that will form the teardrop see you already have one there right there and here is the looping step so once you've done that that's how it's supposed to look so you're supposed to have two bands on this side one teardrop color and one chain color you switch the second and third so you loop not switch but you put the second over the third okay like that and then unloop that band in the middle to lock see and you have your first teardrop okay now you will remove it and turn around turn around every now and then i get a lit okay sorry <laughs> some of you may not even know that so okay shows my age <laughs> okay so the next one is you will get your teardrop color again so from here on every time you turn the first color you will add will always be your teardrop so you get your next teardrop put it on your hook <clears throat> unloop one band remember when you unloop unloop one and then after teardrop you unloop two so it's unlooping is always one and then two so you unloop one chain collar right there and then now you will get your chain collar again 
and unloop to the teardrop okay and then close it then comes the switch again to create the teardrop so you will switch 2 and 3 put 2 over 3 and unloop 3 just like that look at those teardrops so cute ah, I love it okay there so after you unloop you remove it and switch again these are super easy to make but they are beautiful okay after the switch you get your teardrop color again put it on your hook and teardrop <laughs> you teardrop there okay and then you get your chain color again <coughs> and then the actual teardrop Ta -da! and you gloss it gloss <laughs> you close it okay and then you switch two and three and unloop number three to lock Ta-da! and then you remove and replace replace it and then you get your teardrop again unloop the first band put it back and get your chain collar again and unloop the teardrop and put it back and then switch two and three and then unloop number three there see for those who are getting confused i will do it super slow motion okay so i will remove and put it back okay just remember you cannot forget to switch because the teardrops will have to be alternating left right left right left. okay so it's like the song left right left right mm, two, two, mm, two. <laughs> okay so you get your teardrop color okay and then you loop it on that one band you unloop this first band and then you close it and then you get your next chain color and then you unloop the teardrop <coughs> oh wait what did they do why am i wrong already ah oh, yeah wait hold on ah huh? jace jace what's going on hold on i put it back i wasn't able to switch there <laughs> sorry i was talking to you guys too much okay so anyway so here was the last step before the teardrop then you switch two and three okay and then you unloop the middle band there you go there no wonder what's wrong okay and then you remove that and then you replace it just like that okay and then you get your next teardrop you loop the first band and then put it back okay and then you get your chain color and loop those two bands on it and then put it back and then now you switch two and three and then you unloop the third one like that okay i am so addicted to this tie-dye marble or even just the regular tie-dye i love them there's just so much character in the colors okay so before i finish one last time so that you can really double check what you're doing okay so remember, all you have to do is to just to do, to do, all you have to do is to just start with a cap band by using your teardrop color because it's alternating. So you start with a cap band, okay, and then get your first chain band, okay, and then loop the first cap band and then close it there. You will now get your first teardrop color, put it on your hook, loop that first band, then close, and then get your chain color again, which is your black, and unloop those two teardrop, those, well, those te that teardrop band, unloop it, there, and then you close it, okay? And then you switch the second and the third, the third going under, 
and then you unloop that band there okay, <coughs> okay. and then you remove it and just turn it around to do the other side because this is alternating okay so you get your teardrop color again and then you unloop the first band okay and then you put it back after you unloop no sorry after you put it back you get your chain again then loop the teardrop on it then you close it then you switch two and three two over three and then you unloop that middle band see and then you remove and turn around and here last time for the last time okay you get your teardrop collar put it on your hook unloop the first band and then put it back get your chain collar put it on your hook and unloop the teardrop and then put it back and then the switch the two over three and then unloop three Ta -da! and when you're done you just <coughs> sorry and when you're done you just put your c-clip here just there and then you attach it to this one see super cool isn't it okay i really like this bracelet there's something so cute about it and i think i will shoot this marble colors of mine i love it okay that's it that's the one we made so you can experiment with different colors of bands it depends on your trip <laughs> okay whatever your mood is so that is the ghiacciolo ghiacciolo bracelet okay by g the looms for life ghiacciolo by G the Looms to Life. Please make sure to follow G. Super awesome. And if you want to be the first one to make hook only designs, always, and post them as early as you can, that would be so cool. Okay? So, please make sure to hashtag Chase Alvarez, Giacciolo Bracelet, and G the Looms to Life when you make these bracelets because we would love to see your renditions. All right? <laughs> okay. I got it. I'm so hyper. Okay. So, we will see you in our next tutorial and please make sure to hashtag Please make sure to comment in the box below and to give the video a thumbs up if you like it. And hopefully you can share it with other people. So I'll see you in my next tutorial. Bye!